Good morning everyone and welcome back to the channel. My name is Cap and we are on day 11 of our Winter Warrior series. I didn't do anything last night and hung out. I used the supplies I had to make a couple more iron arrows, clear up some space, and then I went through this chest and basically just grabbed everything that would automatically stack with what I already had. And that's pretty much it. And of course it's nice and friggin foggy out and snowing because that's just what it does here. Obviously we're in a winter wonderland. <sighs> I keep saying winter wonderland as if this is a wonderful place to be. We've been attacked by everything, everything. I mean, the only thing that hasn't attacked us yet is a rabbit, and we don't have any holy hand grenades, so if that happens, we're pretty much SOL. But I'm going to run home, jump off all the stuff that we... Uh, uh, <laughs> I'm going to try to get home without dying. Let me reword that properly. Cat come running up at me, and I couldn't even see him. Oh, that's not going to bode well for a good way to start this episode. So, drop off some stuff at the house that we picked up from our little trip over to No Man's Land the previous episode, and then run over to the trader, see if he's got anything for us good. I don't know how many total quests I've done for this idiot so far. So, we might be getting closer to getting a bicycle. That would be great, just because it would make it a lot easier to move back and forth to get supplies from A to B, and to get back and forth in doing some of these quests. Okay, heading over to the trader now, see if he can give us something really good. I've got nothing to sell him. Surprisingly, I have not really had a whole lot that I want to sell with him as far as things. You know, a couple parts here and there, a little bit of extra cash, but we have not found a lot of loot that's a sellable sort of thing so far this series, which is kind of strange. Make it a little bit more challenging to come about getting a ton of, you know, good stuff, good cash. But, you know, it's just the way it is sometimes. You like? I don't know. Let me see. What you got here? Cooking. Needle and Thread, yeah. Volume 6. Oh, Puffer Coats. That's fantastic. And Art of Mining. What do you do? Learn how to craft lanterns, mining hats, and helmet light mods. Well, I already have a Puffer Coat, so this one's not going to help me so much. I need to be able to get number 7, and that's where it'll teach me how to make the other thing. I'm going to take this one because making myself a, a, a helmet light mod would be pretty freaking fantastic. Let me go ahead and get you... Now, let's see. Uh, you haven't reset your inventory yet. What do you have? Let me see. That's southwest. That's really far west. This one, a buried supply chest. Uh, that's probably going to be food. Let's uh, let's do this buried quest. It's not nearly as far. It's still going to be on the other side of town, basically, from where we are. But, it, it, well, hold on. This is, like, right down here. I think our last buried quest was, like, right here. So, we're pretty much right over there. That's not too bad. So, we could get over there, do the buried quest, grab some more crap from home, and get back home. That could work. That could work. And I did level up. I do have one extra point here. Um, I think, I can't remember what I was going to put it into. I know I was well insulated would be great, but I got to get fortitude up. We're way off on that one. This one could actually help out quite a bit. But I'm going to hang on to it. I, wanna, I don't want to spend some time to look through and see what would be most beneficial. And I don't want to risk doing something stupid and spending it on the wrong point. So, um, I don't have my shovel with me. I do need to run back home. I thought I grabbed it, but I actually did not. Oh, completely forgot to read the book you gave me. Yeah, so now I come out. Well, let me see real quick what it would not take to make a helmet light mod. I need a workbench for it, so I need to get that going. Forge steel, scrap, duct tape. I have all of this stuff. I think I have a flashlight. I do. So I have the stuff I can do this, or at least I can get it pretty quickly. I need to get closer to having myself a uh, workbench going, um, which means I'm going to have to probably craft myself another wrench and another hammer. In order to be able to try and make one, because you need one, you need one each one of those to be able to craft that. And I made myself each one so I can use them. Now the hammer I have, I need to be able to do some upgrades to the house, so I may end up having to just craft another one. But what I may do, what I think about doing, do this, grab some stuff from the old house, drop it off there, and then run over and do that gas station there. Since it has a shop in it, there's always a chance that we could find a, a tool that we need, whether it's a wrench or a hammer, and then I wouldn't have to craft it. That would save me some resources, save me some time, because it just takes a while to make those. Now, hold on, I should probably... It stops snowing, it's still foggy as balls out, but that way if that cat decides to show back up over here. Okay, so far, so good. Oh, no, he's still hanging around the cornfield. We're going to go out a little wide this time, see if we can't go around him. So we can get over and maybe our dig quest this time won't have some wild animals wandering right next to us. All right. Well, we found our new digs, but I'm almost certain that the other one is like right on top of that hill there. So we're literally digging right, you know, almost in the exact same area we were. I'm just trying to keep an eye out for the area surrounding me. This isn't too bad. Go ahead and circle all the way in because that would just make my life a little bit easier. Swap you here, swap you there. I did make sure to bring some repair kits this time. I typically end up doing something really stupid and forgetting those and then having to finish the dig quest with a stone shovel or something stupid. 
Okay, so, so far, we're good. Wind's picking back up, so it'll be nice and freezing cold here pretty soon. At least we'll get a bunch of snow from this, which I can convert to murky water and boil some regular water. Anyway, got some digging to do. I'm gonna try and get removed the top layer first here, just because it makes it um, shrink the circle a little bit better, and we have a slightly better chance of figuring out where we're going. So, let's just, uh, let's get to it and see if we can get this circle dug up. Oh, hang on. Dude's already coming to say hi. Hey, what's up? Oh, Tom's wandering over here, too. Yeah, I know, it's terrible. Absolutely terrible. He went all to pieces, too. All right, and now we have Kyle over here trying to come talk some trash to us as well. He didn't last very long. So, so far when we're doing these dig quests, it only seems to be spawning in just the one. So that's not too bad. One I can deal with. They're not too bad at all. And there it is. Buried food stash, just like what I figured. Oh, some coffee. I'm going to go ahead and drink you and take the rest of everything else. Who's coming to say hi? We got Jiggles freezing her tiny little hiney off. Arlene's going to come say hi to us. We'll take care of her too. She's like the den mother here. Hey, what's up? Don't come try and swing at me. I am not a swinger. Despite my dealings with Jiggles here. <laughs> Are you done? Yep, you're done. And poof, there he goes. All right, off to the house real quick to grab some more stuff because we have a full... Uh, I have some stuff here I don't need like that. I don't need that. I don't need... I might as well go ahead and eat you. Just kind of get that back up. This one extra jar I don't need. I'm going to get rid of the shamich just because I don't really need it. Everything else is pretty much okay to kind of hang on to. So, if you're this far into the video and you enjoy it or you just want to help me out one way or another, you know, leave a like on the video. The little thumbs up button helps out quite a bit. And, uh, you know, leave me a comment. Tell me how you're doing in life. What's new in your life? What's what's going on? A snake just respawned right there and spun around in circles. Okay. I'll go ahead and take you. Since you're going to pop in there. But yeah. What's new in your life? What's exciting in your world that you would like to just brag to the world? Leave that in the comments down below. Because I like to hear from you guys. Being able to read, I do read every comment, despite what some people may think about how YouTubers are. I read every comment on every video, and I try to really respond as many of them as possible. Some of them, my only response may be that I can just drop a like on it, you know, throw a heart on it, let you know that I saw it and I really like it. But I do try my best to respond to as many of them as I can. A little bit of a, oh, I almost said a little bit of a drive to get home, but no, we're still hoofing it. So maybe, just maybe, this will be task number seven or whatever the number is that he wants for us. Look, every time we run past that barn coming back from this house, a bear spawns in right there in the corner. And last time we left this area, there was a cat in the cornfield. So which one would I rather deal with? An angry cat or an angry bear? I mean, obviously neither, but hopefully we won't have to deal with either one of them. Okay, no big deal at all. Got everything dropped off there. It's nice and clear outside. The fog is lifted. It's not snowing anymore. We're not freezing. We can actually move at a decent pace. It, uh, yeah, it, it's we run into a lot of the same things here. That is definitely a rinse repeat thing that we have in the video, in these videos of that every day we have a blizzard. Every day it gets foggy as hell. Nobody can see anything. We minorly freeze. We run back and forth to certain areas and bears and cats and wolves spawn in the same places every time. So, yeah, it's almost like a really, really terrible groundhog day, basically. <laughs> Let's see what we can get from him. Maybe something really nice. Hello, How about... Stranger. Howdy. Here something good. Go, friend. Whatever you I need. already have that. Just I don't really need that. Word. First aid kits aren't that... Dang it, man. I guess... Oh, I guess I'll just get the pipe bombs. I got more of those last time. First aid kits I'm okay on. Yes! Freaking yes! We got it. Get the bicycle, baby. I mean, some of these other things would be great to have. Yes! Yes! We got a bicycle! Special jobs. Let's see. Opening trade routes. Oh, there's another trader not too far from here. I really admire you, friend. I Thank admire you, you too. I'll trader Hugh, Trader Joel. Okay, so this one's going to be due east of us, which means we're going to be, in order to get this, we'd have to travel over to here. This is the one little house the little ranger station sent us to last time. We got some hills over here. We're not going over there today, but at least it's an option. Thank you, sir. We got a bicycle! Yeah! A little bit further over here. Oh, hey. Dude, you kind of startled me. Check out my new bike. Do you like it? I like it. 
can probably drop off a couple things we down here. See if we can loot it. Maybe we can get the tools that we need. So you put you in there. Um, I'll put you back down there. We should be good. Okay. Okay, we're going to go right over to the other side of this building. And notice how earlier I said, hey, it's not foggy anymore and it stopped snowing. Guess what? It's foggy and snowing again. Hey, secret loot. Coffee, sham, shotgun shells. Uh, tell you what, I'll just eat you. We'll go ahead and top everything off. I'm going to go ahead and drink you. Okay, I can scrap you, steel sledgehammer parts. I can sell those and those will stack. That's not too bad. I'm going to leave that behind. There we go. That way we're not completely encumbered when we show up over here. All right, I've been through this shop enough times that you, there's always a chance that I could make it through here without getting any major surprises, but, you know, that don't really mean anything at all. Okay, so that's one way to go in. We're going to check out front to see if there's anything special in any of these gas pumps. Looks like a couple of them are out of service. A little bit extra gas. Arlene wandering around over there. We will check these cars because we do have a chance to get some tools this way. The thing we need today, we need a wrench and a hammer. Okay, well, that's all of that. Nothing else over here. Let's get inside, see if we can't get some sneaky damage here. I know there's some idiots down below. See if we can walk in here without anybody waking up. Okay, got a little bit of frame drops here. It's just probably all the idiots downstairs spawning in. Let's go ahead and check the car. See if, uh, and we woke everybody up. That's okay. Um, no, I'm not going to. I'll take those, I guess. Hey, Owen, is this your shop? I don't think any one of these cars are anywhere closer to getting fixed than probably... Oh, hey, look at you ducking. I mean, I think you fell, but we're, we'll, I'll say you ducked. <laughs> you fell. What an idiot. Okay, so that's the way we're supposed to go. Here comes Tim and Arlene. Why are y'all down here? She looks like she could work in a shop. No. Ow, I'm stuck on something. The toolbox. I backed into the corner right next to the toolbox. Okay. Great. That's fan damn -tastic. Okay. Here. Good God. That's not funny at all. That's not even slightly funny. Look at all those afflictions. Look what you two idiots did. That's wonderful. Thanks a lot. Now I got all this other afflictions going on over here. Well, look, we got mild infection, which we can treat at home. We got an abrasion, which I just used the health kit. So it'll go up a little bit. And I cannot believe y'all did that. What a bunch of morons. Come up and give me an infection. I'll take your eggs just because. Do you leave me anything else down here? I need to run back up into the top area here and do a search for that. Make sure there's nothing else that they... Um, left for me up there. I think there's a backpack in here, right? Yep. Cannot believe that. Empty jars we don't want. We have plenty of those. Okay. I think that's everything that's just sitting right here. We gotta go that way to get inside the shop, and we can bust in if we want to, but I wanna run up here. I think that we got these cabinets over here that we can search. I cannot believe I have an infection already. Don't want that. I don't want... Oh, crap. That doesn't sound good. Can hear the tiger. Some pea soup. You know what? I'll go ahead and do this. That'll help out get a little bit of the health. Might as well, right? Iron. That's not too bad. We can do some upgrades with that. I am not. I didn't bring a wrench, so I can't take apart these cars anyway. I'm hoping the cat is outside the shop and trying to get in over there and not inside the shop and waiting for me to pop out and get my head chewed off. Bruce hanging out in the bathroom. Sorry to ruin your lunch break, man. Huh? Get up. Can I have my arrow back? No. All right. Well, let's see if you had anything good in here. Cardboard box with... Ooh, compound bow schematic. That would be great to have a compound bow. Uh, I'll close that real quick. I need to have bow parts, obviously, to make a compound bow. Um, bow parts. I need to have five of those. I don't know how many of those I have at the house. I don't remember how many I've already picked up. I think I've seen some. I'm pretty sure I've been hanging on to them. But then again, I might be misremembering entirely. So um, we'll have to keep an eye on those. Make sure we can find them. We can keep them. Maybe, just maybe, we could get our... Oh, nice. Some old money. Maybe, just maybe, we can get ourselves a compound bow pretty soon instead of this primitive bow that we've been rocking for a long time now. Mega Crush, good for when we need to haul some butt. Uh, coffee beans, we don't need those. Okay, all right, see if we can take her out a little higher. And she went down, that's good. I know there's plenty of idiots in here, but 
If I can take them out before they notice I'm here, that would just be great. Oh, God. We're heading outside, and this is the general direction I was hearing the meowing from earlier. Ugh. Oh. I'm going to check your gas pump real quick. Oh, God. Here, kitty, kitty, kitty. Where are you? Are you outside the fence? I can, I heard it growl, but I don't know where it went. Oh, good. We didn't wake up. Skeletor hanging out over here by the window. Boom! I don't know where that cat went. I hope he's not inside the building because that just not bode well for me at all. I think that's everybody that was in the yard. I'm trying to make sure I know where this cat is real quick. I, ow, stupid. Just just full on dumb today, man. We are, we are not having a good day. I mean, we're, we haven't died yet. What the hell? Are y'all inside the building and you're trying to figure out or are you on top and you're going to drop down on top of me? I'm just trying to figure out which direction I need to make sure I don't get hit from. Rocks and plastic. I guess I'll take both of those. Hang on. Okay, well, everybody's awake. Hey, there's Jiggles. Oh, they're in the bathroom next to me. Let's go say hi. Another Jiggles in here. Doors closed. Kyle. Uh-oh. See, once again, you know, Kyle and two strippers in here. That's That seems to be a recurring trend around here. There's one dude hanging out and two strippers. I mean, I'm not judging. You do whatever makes you happy or whatever, but just seems a little bit fishy that that's what we keep running into. What the hell are you doing, dude? You should probably lay back down. Close you in case there's anybody upstairs wants to come say hi. Were you the only one in the bathroom? So, nothing good in the bathroom. Let's switch back over here so you guys can see. I'm going to try my best to make myself a uh, helmet light here in the very near future. So, it'll be a lot easier for you guys to see from here going forward. Uh, let me see. I could have swore there was like a dog in here. Okay, maybe not. That, I'm fine with that. I, I'm really happy that there's not. I, I'm not sure. Maybe I'm misremembering or I'm thinking of another office building entirely. Uh, I'll scrap you and take the iron. Scrap you, scrap you, take the feathers and the wood and leave the hand. There was nothing. There was In this box, it was just sand. There's nothing in there either. We got one in the corner here. Let's see if we can bust it open. Maybe we'll get something good from that one. Okay, working stiff tools. I need a wrench or a hammer. Wrench or a hammer. Wrench. Or frames, I guess. Those are okay. That's fine. I'm not unhappy with that, but. Okay, we searched every shelf that was in here. The only thing we found was one can of pears and some nails. That's the only thing they had in this entire store. Out of all these shelves that was here, we've, there was a bunch of bones, some nar nasty meat that we're not taking with us. Is there anybody under the stairs? No, I think there's a box hidden in the corner over there. I need to check out, though. And again, I didn't bring my shovel for whatever reason. I keep forgetting that I actually need cobblestone. That would just be kind of useful to have. Wrench your hammer. One military fiber and more frames okay well we're oops i mean to check that one we're good on frames we've caught a lot of frames lately i mean i use them a lot and i make them a lot so i'm, I'm okay with finding some of them but again i'd really rather find a tool are you no wait this should wake everybody else up just beat on some iron out there another empty jar oh yeah that's something else we found a lot of in the store okay so there's idiots up on the roof in this top in the yep them right there Oh, I was about to say, did they not wake up? Dude, oh, hey, what's up? Don't run at me. Hang on. Did you just... There's a lot going on right there. Tell you what, I'll let you all kind of pile up for a second and see if we can't get a nice little collateral shot before I beat you in the face. Ready? Dude! We just got a three-piece! Oh! There's one head. There's one head. Oh, he didn't blow his head off, but we did kill him. Three head shots, baby. Oh, that's fantastic. I think there's usually somebody up in the roof over here, too. If they didn't already fall down. Let's make some noise. Come on down, morons. Hello? No? Okay. All right. We can loot this general area in peace, then. More murky water. I'm not taking any more murky water today. I'm just not going to do it. Uh -uh. I don't have any vitamins on me, so I don't want to risk getting the Trotskys because I decided to eat one on accident. So, without having the necessary stuff to... Uh, you know, keep me from hurting myself when I eat them. It's kind of pointless to even have them. It's definitely getting some lag in here, so I'm not quite sure if everything's popping in on the rooftop. 
if they're out on the roof trying to maybe I woke everybody else up on the roof already and they're gonna try and figure out how to get to me. Well you just keep on doing your thing, man. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna stop you, but I'll be out there in a minute. Nice, more iron arrowheads. Uh, get, I have some feathers at home, so I'm this, some wood, some iron arrowheads, good to go. Let's see. Lead, I have some, and rocks, I have some, so those will stack. Sweet. You had anything? Nah. Not had anything there either. Make sure nobody's going to fall on me. Something good. More brass. Okay, well, it stacks. I'm not taking the sand. I don't need it. I don't have a concrete maker. Nobody's going to try and sneak around this way. Some level six padded armor. You know what, pink? I'm going to go ahead and use those. I'll throw the bone away. Okay, which current pants am I wearing? These are level five. These are level six. So they are technically better than this one. Uh, here, let me, let me do this. Let me go ahead and swap you out. Complete. These don't sell for anything, so I can scrap you. Use it to repair you. And bam. Now it works, and I can get rid of you. Sweet. Got slightly better pants. That actually works out pretty nicely. Stop it. Okay, I think there's somebody sleeping right over there. Oh, there's a bird. Okay, time to test out our archery skills. If I had a silencer on a gun, I'd just shoot this little bugger. Actually, you know what? Let's see if we can sneak around this way and get a better shot so we don't have to waste an arrow. Because if I miss, it's going to go in downtown somewhere. I'd rather get rid of the bird first. Yeah! Eat it. Okay, get rid of this dude. Because I don't think I can kill Gary in one hit. We're definitely going to try, of course. But I don't know if I can or not. Dude's got a solid noggin up there. Well, he's a unicorn now. Or maybe even a narwhal. Can I have my arrow back? Thank you. And down he went. Did the bird go all the way down? Hey, I need my arrow back. Okay, I don't remember if there's anything in these things, but we'll check them. Doesn't look like it. Probably some more birds over there. I see Tim laying on the floor. Yeah, I knew, I knew there was another bird. Ooh, getting some frame drops. Sweet, sweet. Jiggles over there trying to show us all that she has. See if we can hit Tim in the back of the head. Blew his mind. I'm not going to be mean and shoot her in the lady biz. That's just kind of mean. I mean. She's wearing a party dress. And it almost seems inappropriate. I mean, typically I would, but again, I'm trying not to be inappropriate today. How about some antibiotics just for giggles? Uh, ooh, nice! Antibiotics! Hell yeah! I don't have to use any of my own. Sweet. Much appreciation. Then some steroids. Fortunately, we don't have too far to have to go to get back home. There's a dog on the roof. There's always a dog on the roof. Hi! Are you downstairs? Where are you? You sure are making a lot of noise. Oh, yeah. I know. I'm excited to see me, too. Um, uh, nope. I can't kill that cat in one hit from here, and all it'll do is he'll come running over here, and then I'll have a pissed-off cat. Okay, so we have some feathers now. So what I can do for you recipe iron arrows can make seven of them bad boys That'll clear up a spot right there. Don't need you Go ahead and eat you because why not? Okay, y'all can keep doing your thing. Let's get back up here I think the only thing that's on the roof up here is the dog and if we cannot wake him up That'd just be fantastic. He should be right on the other side of that crate Yep, I see ya Boom, baby. And the dog went down. Oh, hey. Sorry, Skeletor. Did I kill your pet doggy? I don't feel bad. You would have sicked him on me the moment you had a chance to. You know it. Give my arrow back. All right. Main loot time. And then we'll be done with this particular POI. We did not get the tools that we were hoping for. Do I have any lockpicks? I've got 10. How about some shotgun ammo? Shotgun ammo, a couple iron arrows, nice, and bullet casings, those are fine. Okay, one of you, one of you right here is going to give me what I need. I can feel it. Chrysanthemum? I'll go ahead and take you. We're not far from home. All right, let's bust these open. All right, passing gas first. Uh, ratchet schematic, we already have that. We'll just read you, read you, take the shale. We don't have a chemistry station, or do we even know how to make one? More frames and more cobblestone and gas and repair kits. Not a bad thing to have. We don't have anything to put gas in just yet. You know, if you want to bless us with a mini bike, that'd be fantastic. Go ahead and use you real quick. And we're not even encumbered. Get rid of that one extra jar here. Was there anything in this toolbox? How about a tool? I, one extra duct tape I don't have to make myself. That is okay. All right. I think that's everything that's up here. 
yeah, I totally made a base up here in one of my very early series. Um, I created a little funnel part right there, and so when they were coming in, I'd just stand here and just beat them in the face and then move that off there so that when they did fall, they would fall off the building. It was great. Hey, Lois, do you finally figure how to get inside? Hey, there's a door right over... Where is it? Hey, you hang on right there. I'll come find you. I'll show you how to get out. Gotta help all these trapped zombies, man. I feel bad leaving them behind. Uh, actually, which way is home? Home is that way. Hang on, we gotta go help Lois. I promised I'd help her. Hey! Oh, sorry. I missed. Where did you come from? <laughs> Dude crawled his way all the way around the building and upstairs. That's dedication, man. Props to you. Oh, wait, hang on. Food in the middle of the table that I did not get. Red tea and some actual food. Nice. Okay, so we can just bail off the roof if we need to. Uh, let's see. We need to go that way. Wait, our new home. Where's our sleeping bag at? That way. Okay, so we need to go down here. Ugh, not that stupid. Where'd that cat go? I think he was around that other side over there. So we can jump up on that. Hurt ourselves again because this is what we do. Moron. We don't have too far to have to go to get home. Look at that. Right here. That's fantastic. Nice. 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 Ugh. Nice full inventory. Got some loot. I got a skill point to use. Okay, so in order to be able to make a workbench, I'm going to have to use the tools that I have here. I've got, let me see, forged iron mechanical parts and wood. Let me see how much of that stuff I actually have. Forged iron, I may not have enough on that just yet. Mechanical parts, I may not have enough on that. How much do I actually need? I need more, and I need more. Okay, so I don't have enough of either one of those yet. I can make some forged iron in this. I need to get a bunch of stuff going in here first. It's not really going to help us out. Uh, let me see. Where's all my clay? I think I put it up earlier. Well, all right, guys. That's going to be pretty much it for the day. I'm going to spend the rest of the night here. There's not a whole lot of time left. We don't have another task for him yet. We had a long ways to go to get the next one. I'm going to work on trying to get a bunch of stuff smelted in here so that I can um, start getting closer to making myself a workbench. I'm going to try my best to get a workbench, at least crafting by tonight, drop that in there, and we can start making our way towards getting a helmet light mod. Uh, I think I thought I had some, yeah, I do have some more iron in here. Get you in here as well, and turn you on, get all you crafting in there, get some more forged iron. Mechanical parts going to be the thing that's a little bit harder to find. I do have a wrench, for now, that I can uh, eventually use to drop off in here, but uh, let me grab you and you real quick. Go ahead and make the last couple of these arrows, just to get them out of my inventory. But that's pretty much it. But I uh, hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, would you do me a favor and leave a like on it? And if you're new here, make sure you subscribe. If you're not already, so you don't miss our future videos, of course. And in the meantime, you guys have a fantastic day. And I will talk to you later.